Hey, what's up you guys? It's Tyler. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new today. This is a bonus video. This is literally just going to be me talking about random stuff that doesn't matter for a little bit of time. Um, because that's what I want to do right now. Anyways, you're sitting with me at 11pm waiting for my boyfriend to get home. I am unboxing a blood pressure machine because I have heart issues. And I just want to kind of talk about like doctor things for a minute because I hate doctors so much. Look at this. <laughs> also, excuse me and my no eyebrows. I am not wearing makeup because I, it's 11 p.m. I'm not going to put makeup on to do a video. Um, I have a doctor's appointment on Wednesday. I'm filming this on Sunday. And I also have a doctor's appointment next Wednesday. And I have to get my blood work done, which I have a phobia of getting blood work done, so. There's no batteries in this. Why did I, why did I buy this? Everything needs batteries and I don't have any. I don't have any fucking batteries. Okay. Lovely. <laughs> Anyways, I have a doctor, just like a normal GP doctor appointment Wednesday. And then the Wednesday after that, I have a gynecologist appointment, which I feel weird talking about that because it's like, I don't know, like weird, but I'm on birth control and the doctor that I have right now, the gynecologist that I have right now, I don't like her because she scares me. Um, she said like really insensitive things about past traumatic things that have happened to me and like why I'm uncomfortable with exams. Um, basically, I'm 21. And, you know, that's the time you get a pap smear. I'm not doing that. But I'm kind of being forced to by that doctor or she won't give me more birth control. And I just, I can't. Listen, if I absolutely have to, if this next doctor does not work out, the new one that I'm going to next Wednesday, if that doesn't work out, then I'm just going to have to do it. But it's so frustrating to have a doctor. Um tell me you have to get this invasive exam to get the medication that you've been prescribed since you were 15 years old. I've been on this one birth control since I was like 15, but now I have to get a pap smear to get my medication refilled. Also this new doctor, um, she's new to me. Um, the doctor that I started with, she was amazing. Um, she never asked any questions, which is not good because I swear people are getting prescribed birth control and they have no idea the risk and stuff. Also, ignore this. Girl, I'm just coming at you in my in my living room, okay? Don't come at me. Um, my old doctor was really nice. She would just give me medication whenever I need it. This doctor does not do that. She just... I don't know. I don't like this. I don't like the new doctor that I have. So I'm getting a new doctor. And I have to get blood work done, which like I said, I have a major phobia. I had two really, really bad experiences the last two times that I went to get blood drawn. It was horrible and I'm so scared, but I have to do it. I'm going to try to get my new general doctor to give me like anxiety medication. Um, and we'll see how that goes, but I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. Y'all, I need help. Anyways, in July, I have to go to my cardiologist, my heart doctor, because I have heart problems. Um, and I have to get an echo done again, which I did that last year. I don't know why they're doing it again. They never explained it to me. So honestly, I kind of want to cancel it because I'm gonna pay $300 out of pocket for this fucking echo. And nothing's wrong with my heart, by the way. I've had an EKG done or ECG I think I've had both of them done. I don't know. I don't know. I've also had a CT done on my heart. I've also had an echo done on my heart. I've also had a stress test done on my heart. Nothing is like actually wrong with my heart other than it beats really, really fast for no reason. Um, so why are we doing this? Why am I paying? I don't know. I don't know. Also, oh my God. Sorry, this is a story time, me and my frizzy hair. Um, story down. 
I am on a beta blocker. I'm on an extended release beta blocker. It's metroprolol. I don't know if that's how you say it. Um, I'm on it two times a day, which is not allowed because it's extended release. You just take it one time a day. But my doctor prescribed it to me two times a day, but she never wrote it down. So, um, I went to refill my medication and I've been on this medication for months now. Like I've been on it two times a day for months. So it hasn't been a problem. And then I go to refill it and it's only a quantity of 30. So that would be a 15 day supply. And I'm like, girl, I'm paying $20 for 15 days. Are you freaking kidding me? I am broke. I can't do it. I cannot do it. So I called them. I'm like, hey, I only have a quantity of 30. Like, can I go up to like a two month supply like I've been on for a long time she was like yeah yeah that's fine and I was like okay good and then she gave me a 90 day or a 90 quantity supply which is not a 90 day supply because I take it two times a day so I called back I'm like hey I'm actually taking this two times a day and I was speaking to a different nurse or something and she was like why are you taking this two times a day you should not be doing that that's this is extended release you should not be doing that and I'm like First of all, is this dangerous? I didn't ask that because I'm just, I don't, I'm just a girl. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Basically, she never wrote down that I was taking two times a day. Anywhere. She never wrote it down. My doctor never wrote down that I was taking it two times a day. And I've been taking it for months. I've gotten multiple refills of me taking it two times a day with it on the bottle two times a day. But somehow there is no record anywhere just none so what I don't know I'm am I even gonna upload this I don't know but I need to go that was me ranting please help me help my hair because my hair is falling out <laughs> anyways I need to figure this out because my doctor is requiring me to do this anyways bye love you Thanks.